everyone, it's me, YD28, and welcome back to my channel with my Sims 4 Let's Play Part 5. Um, we are, you know, waiting to have our baby. Yes, waiting to have our baby. I've actually recorded this for the second time because my fraps... <sighs> Sometimes it glitches and doesn't record when I do my hotkeys, so that's kind of annoying. <laughs> Just a smidgen, so, uh, yeah, uh, I won't say any spoilers, but, you know, uh, I'm recording this pregnancy for the second time. So, um, yes, um, I realized in that recording that, uh, Julia did not take Justin's last name. Ebony. Which is kind of weird because I thought we would. And I'm wondering if there is a way to change the name. So if you guys know a way to change their last name, uh, let me know. And I wanted to rename this dino Spyro the Dragon. Even though he's not purple. Um, he's reading a book. He's reading a uh, non-fiction book. A mountain-sized glob of coconut pudding is lobbed into orbit to study its potential for sustaining life on other planets. Amazing. Amazing! And the cover is a black tie suit. Of course, that makes total sense. So, um... I'm thinking we should be friendly with somebody, but I don't think we have many, many friends. <laughs> yeah, not at all. I don't like any of these people. <laughs> Um, I was thinking, he had a good workout. A good workout always boosts the spirits. That's a lovely buddy. Oh, I kind of just want her to go into labor. Like, come on. <laughs> Probably because I already played this. But I guess uh, because we don't have work today. He does want to go on two dates with his spouse. So we'll ask her on a date over here. Let's ask on date. Are we not going to, are, are we not going? Are, are we not going? <laughs> ask on date, come on. Justin, come on, how can you be so nervous about asking her on a date now? Yes. She's like sure, I guess. She looks so unsure. Um, I think we'll just head over to the park. It's a nice day. The park is nice. You know? I mean, there's so ma only so many lots we can actually go to. Um, so, like, you know, it's not that big of a deal. Um, I do want him to go to the gym eventually, but um, because she's pregnant, I don't really don't want to leave her alone. It freaks me out each time because I'm like, oh my god, she's no longer pregnant. And then I go sideways. <laughs> That's my reaction each time. So we need to have silver, um, oh, she's feeling nauseous, I think. We're going to brighten our day. Ask to feel the baby. Compliment appearance. Tell an engaging story. And then we got to flirt three different ways. So we'll flirt and caress her cheek and embrace her. And we're going to see people walking by, running by. There's a lot of people here today. Mm, yes. Okay, we've seen their interactions a lot. I'll let them interact. There's someone sleeping on the couch, on the bench. This homeless guy. That's so crazy. There are homeless people. Look at these guys. Here's a fisherman and Liberty Lee. I think we talked to her another time. Or was that someone else? Cameron Gray. He kind of looks like Mortimer Goth. Vincent Tackett. I think we've seen him before. Yeah. And some kids playing on the monkey bars. Who are these kids? This is, I don't know, Zachary Sierra and Jung Fe Jefferson. Okay, wow, that was so loud. I'm so sorry. Who is this bald man? Maybell Posey. Give your date a massage. Okay. Let's do it. Massages are always good. There we go. And we're silver already. 
Turp system. So uh, we can um, meet new people then because we've done our job. We got a silver and that's all his aspiration wants. So let's pause the game. What is over here? Can we go over here? What is this? Use bathroom. Oh, they're bathroom stalls. Public bathroom stalls. That's so cool. What's this? Is that a meteorite? Dig. Come dig this. Come dig this right now, Justin. I want to see you dig it. Dig it, dig it, dig it, dig it, dig it. What? We found a, a crystal? One peach. A peach crystal? What? Call geo cancel about sample. Do it. What does this mean? What? Oh, and Julia's on her way over here. Like, what are you doing? Look at her bottle. That's so cute. Hi. Okay, so what are we doing? Peach is composed of alkanite, alkanite, and singelin with a ratio of about 3 to 1. What does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? So what can I use it for? What? I don't understand. <laughs> okay, let's place it in the world. I did it. What does it do? Emotional aura? What does that do? Shush. He's flattered. What does this do? Energizing decor. We can study it? Okay, you know what? Put an inventory, please. Okay, cool. Um, we'll have to put that in the house. I have no idea what that even means. Can we go down this way? This park is huge. There's another one over here. Dig this one. I'm so intrigued. I am so intrigued. This one looks gross. Looks like it has boogers on it. <laughs> what? We got a capsule? A mysterious time capsule. Open it. What's inside? Place in the world. It's a gnome. It's a gnome. Marcubus. Put in inventory. Cool. Well, how neat. You can already, like, start, um... Exploring things, we can look for frogs, and this is a lily flower that is no longer in bloom. How intriguing! And here's some plants. This is a pear tree. How nice! How very nice! And we can rummage through the garbage. What? We should maybe try go fishing. I don't know. How do we fish? Can't I just click on the what? How do I go fishing? Oh look, there's people over here. Huh. We got a leaf frog. Oh. Oh, you click on the fishing spots. Let's go fishing. That sounds fun. Julia, you come fishing too. We're having a casual discussion with someone actually who... Let's... Okay, let's... Never mind. Don't go fishing. Talk to this chick. Who is she? She's wearing a very weird outfit. But she looks kind of nice. She's cute. We're uncomfortable because we gotta pee really badly. Complain about problems. Who's Sean? Oh, she's feeling flirty. She's like, I honestly don't know you and I honestly don't care. Her voice I is so seen. low. Oh my lordy. <laughs> oh my lordy. Okay, we don't have time for this. We gotta go pee. Oh, she's gonna go use the actual, that bathroom bathroom. Look at her walk. Oh my god. It's so funny. Oh my god, this place is bopping. Bopping. Yeah, I know, sweetheart. We really need to pee. Okay, go in there. There we go. All better. You see? Date complete, and we earned the silver medal. Um, so he's gonna stop fishing. Come here. And, uh... Oh, actually, he's gonna come here. She's cooking some burgers. That's nice. That's nice. 
She reached cooking level three, so now she can make fried tilapia, chocolate chip cookies, and pancakes. She can also talk and about cooking with other Sims. So we're going to grab a serving, and he's going to grab a serving. And then after that, we'll head home. Okay, sit on the other side of her. Sure. Uh, Sally. We can make out with her? What? Let's do it. Do it. Do it. Oh, aren't they sweet? Their lips are touching awkwardly, so <laughs> I think EA needs to fix that. Uh, we're going to put this in our inventory and then travel home. Hi, are we traveling home? Nope. Travel with Julia. Yes, goodness gracious. And we're going to come home. Yes. I hope this baby comes quick. I'd like the baby to come quick. That would be nice. Alright, home. Home is where the heart is. He's gonna come take a speedy shower. And uh, she's not even that tired and it's 10 o'clock at night, which is good. Good, 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 sweetie. Clean out the spoiled food then. Since you're not tired. There we go. Now she is. Put away this book. She wants to woohoo with Justin and become inspired, I guess, for cooking, but she's going to come sleep. Actually, we could woohoo. You know, they say woohoo is um, good during pregnancy. Just saying. Baller. I like that you can still woohoo when you're pregnant. Bow chicka wow wow. Amazing. So, he's not that tired, so he's gonna stay up. For work, he needs to, um... Oh, he's done his work. So he doesn't need to do anything. It's kind of bummy, but, uh, actually, he'll come sleep. Don't work out some more. <laughs> Go to sleep, and I'll see you guys when, um... I think they have work in the morning. Oh, she's up. What is she up for? Oh, of course, you gotta pee. Go pee. And then sleep. Um, pleasantly satisfied. That woohoo was something to remember. Of course, it was pleasantly satisfying. Um, yeah, I think they have work tomorrow, and I think there's no mat leave. So, she is going to go to work at 10 till 7, and she's, like, in her third trimester. Yep, like, the baby's due today. Uh, I might make her skip work just for today. I don't think you can call in sick either. No, there's no way. So, uh, I don't know. So, uh, I think I'm gonna make her stay home. So, I'll see you guys when Justin gets home from work or if she goes into labor. Yeah. And good morning, guys. Um, I'm making Julia take a thoughtful shower because she wants to get inspired. Well, and then we'll use the toilet. Julia has worked in an hour and I'm not gonna let her go to work. It's good money, but we really don't need it. Well, not that we don't need it, but, I mean, like, she's gonna give birth. Like, real soon. <laughs> real soon. So, she's inspired, so she wants to serve a group meal. I think we'll serve egg and toast. That sounds good. Or, 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 or. Can I cook something else? Oh. Let's do chocolate chip cookies instead. Not that one. Okay. Okay, cool. So, you get the money back. No, don't go to work. Okay. It's fine. Yeah, we're skipping work. It's fine. We're gonna make chocolate chip cookies. Nom nom nom. Mmm, <laughs> good, good, good. Look how big her belly is. Holy crap. My stomach is... And she put on the radio so she could listen to the radio while she's cooking... Baking cookies. So she's jamming in between her stirs. Look, those look delicious. Yes, Julia, yes. Get it, girl. Get it. Go to work. No, don't go to work. <laughs> Stay home. You're about to give birth. Oh, my God. I totally sped past that. Look how delicious these are. Grab a serving. 
grab a serving. Eat it, eat it, eat it. Look how yummy. Look how she chews it. It's so cute. Oh, she's happy. Look how... Oh my god, she's humongous. So yes. So we're just waiting patiently but impatiently for Julia to go into labor. So... Our phone is ringing. Should I pick it up? Crap. Escape. Crap. Okay. Fork chat. If she misses too many days, her job performance will <laughs> suffer. This reminds me of Sims 1 or Sims 2 where like you could skip days, but um, as long as you didn't pick up the phone, you were fine. So we're going to put these away. Um, and I guess we'll come here and do some programming actually so that um, we're doing something for work because we have to practice programming for four hours. And increase our skill. Oh, also, I added in these things that Justin found in the um, world. So we're gonna enable emotional, or yeah, enable emotional aura. I don't know what that does. Yeah, I don't know what that does. Enable emotional aura. I don't know what this does either. It's playful, oh, playful decor, and what is this one? Energizing decor. Oh, okay. Disable that. And uh, disable that. But that's really, really cool that, like, there are things that affect the environment. I hate that this is flashing. Like, I know she's missing work, and I know she's late for work. She's pregnant. How do you expect her to work when she's pregnant? Oh, it's kind of annoying. Just saying. Just saying. That's kind of annoying. <laughs> Just a smidgen. But anyways, she's uh, practiced hours programming for five hours now already. Her back is kind of hurting, I think. Something's broken. Oh, the toilet. God damn it. Gotta keep replacing that. She's gonna come clean. Oh, actually, she has to come pee. So, she's done two hours. She's halfway done. No big deal. Oh, and Justin just got promoted to intelligence researcher. Justin has been promoted to intelligence researcher. He will now make an additional two simoleons per hour for a grand total of 19 simoleons per hour. He also received the following bonus, 349 simoleons, the swiveler, and intelligence research on the computer. Super cool. So. So he can come here and... Da -da -dum. Do intelligence research. But I wonder what... Reach level 2 of the programming skill. What? Okay. Practice programming, I guess, then. Um, I know she's missing work. Bruh. Anyway, she cleaned that quite well. Oh, no. You don't need to use the toilet. Uh, come take a nap. Because I don't know when you're about to go into labor. So... He's feeling energized for no 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 known reason, but we're waiting. Um, he's gonna get his programming skill up to level two. Hi hi hi. Yes. Very good, very good. Halfway done. Yeah, and I'm gonna make this the kids' room. I think we're gonna have two kids, maybe. She's feeling quite energized. Oh my god, it's so red. Oh, she's coming to dance. She loves it. Alright, come open. Eat. Leftover chocolate chip cookies. Because that's amazing. You're going to do the same thing. After you get level 2. Because you're almost done. Come on, get it, 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 go! Yes! Cool. Now he's all set. Hopefully he'll get promoted quite quickly. Earn the monies because, I don't know, she's going to be staying home more. Look at her face. She's like, I hate my life. I am humongous and I feel so awkward. Come use the toilet, my dear. 
Um, yeah. Cookies don't really fill you up too much, but cookies make him super excited. He loves cookies. Cookies are the best. He has to pee too. Um, yeah. So we're waiting, 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 waiting. Please pop. Come on. Come on. Pop, pop, pop. Have this baby. Have this baby. Okay, let's go to sleep. You're too tired. Maybe that will help. It's 8 p.m. I think I'm going to get him to do some exercises. Do push-ups. Do sit-ups. Stretch. Do more push-ups. Do more sit-ups. Okay, she's gone into labor. Holy snap. Oh, I know, sweetie. Oh. I know. Oh, oh no. Oh. She's not feeling it right now. She's gonna go dance to keep her baby bump going. So we can have the baby at the hospital, or we can just have baby now. See how uncomfortable she's dancing? Oh my god, look, she's so cute. She's just like waving her arms like, oh, this is awkward. Um, she's too miserable. Complain about your problems because you're feeling uncomfortable. Can we do anything else? That's all? Um, hmm. Well, she's liking the dancing. He's tense because he's having pre-parental panic. It's go time. There's a new baby on the way. A little freak out is understandable. Let's see, he can vent to her. Although I don't think you should really vent to her at all. You're taking out the trash. Julia, don't take out the trash right now. He'll throw away the trash. No, don't chat with her. Okay, I mean like you're distracting her, but throw out that trash, please. Empty trash. Okay, she's like very uncomfortable. It hurts. It hurts. It hurts her a lot, but she's hungry. She's like, I need to eat, even though you really can't eat when you're giving, like, I don't know. I don't think I'd ever be able to eat. How much longer? Oh my god, 26 minutes. Okay. I think you can just have the baby at any time. But I was thinking, you know what, we'll just have the, uh, Okay, what's his last name? Because I want the baby to have his last name more, okay. So she's trying to sleep, but I think... Julia's having the baby. Here we go. Here we go, here we go. Okay. I know. I know it hurts. I know, I know, I know, I know, Julia. <laughs> okay. Frozen? No good? Oh, it's because I'm frozen in this. So, the baby's last name is Moore, and we just had a baby boy. And last time I named him Julian. We had a boy this time first time but it didn't record so um yes his name is julian moore now stop because i need to put this back like this. continue And she's just gonna go back to sleep just like that but the baby's wiggling around in his little crib and you see there are so many options you can talk to him rock him make a silly face at him cuddle with him coo at him bounce him change his diaper feed him which is breastfeed and bottle feed there are more choices we can age him up so we can age him up at any time um, I honestly I don't know how long they stay babies to and stay babies for and then you can show them off to someone
Oh, the baby's sad. Oh, I wonder why he's sad. Justin, come over. Maybe shoosh him? We can shoosh him? And maybe coo at him? Oh my god, that is so cute. Look at his bottom lip. Oh my god, I'm dying. Oh my god, I'm dying. It's so cute. Now he's happy. Did he just get like reset? Come on, coo at him. <laughs> oh my god, make a silly face at him. Oh, I love how they support the head. Oh my god. No, do it again. I see. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm dying. It is so freaking cute. Julia is um, quite sluggish again and, you know, upset, but happy from the baby. Maybe he needs to eat? Let's bottle feed him. Justin's a very, very good daddy. Super good. Yeah, I don't know how long they stay babies for. Probably the same time as before. Because the lifespan is, like, we're aging up in 10 days to uh, a regular adult. Because we're young adults. Um, same with her. So, uh, oh, I think he's asleep now. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yes. Okay. Okay. I better end this part here or I'm just going to keep going. And the baby's so freaking cute. And oh, my goodness. If you guys like this part, please do give it a fat thumbs up. And subscribe to me for more videos as I put them up fairly regularly. Um, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.